After getting head by Mew's mom, Hajime pretty much just left Mew. Said, we're going to get some smokes. We're going to get some milk. We'll go. We'll come back for you. But I don't know when. We're done with Mew. Kind of sad. Kind of sad. Because, like, I enjoyed the the papa moments whenever Mew was put in danger or whenever like Mew would ask Hajime to do something you know he would go into this like his paternal instincts would kick in and that was some fun moments but it is what it is now more importantly the plot is thickening the demons are back in the humans and basically the bully is also getting controlled by the demon guy anyways everybody is under control Meld Gigachat got backstabbed by the bully and whoever that was person was attacking. I think that Meld will be fine. He's too important of a character. I hope that won't be sacrificed right now. Who can save us though? The princess know what's going on. But other than that, I think it's going to be Shizuka, right? Sorry, Shizuku. Shizuku has to clutch pretty soon, right? Koki and Shizuku, I hope, will make some kind of group and they'll be able to kind of like fight it back. And then maybe Hajime will also step in. We'll find out. Let's begin today's reaction. These are the farm girls, right? Best girl, Shizuku, let's go. Let's go, Shizuku. All the guards are controlled. Hmm. I hope he's good. Like, if Melda's killed off there, I'll be so fucking pissed. This motherfucker, dude. There's no way you could kill Melda, you coward. Watch him forgive him, too, dude. This piece of you, you're really going for a second? Let's go, Meld, Giga Chat. Giga Chat, Meld. Oh, yeah. But he's still injured. Fuck. Shizuku, come on. Koki, someone else. Please. Please. Yeah. They're reading you. Damn. <laughs> Just knocked them out. What the fuck? What did he just do there? No! Just stab him! Just kill him! It looks like Daisuke is able to kind of like control them, huh? Yo, let's go, Mel. <laughs> See? Non-lethal attacks, dude, because he's so nice. Oh, I think this is Jose. Yeah, Jose, you little bitch. <laughs> Damn, he gave him a lariat. Bro, Jose, you're demoted. Fuck you. Now, Daisuke, get your ass back here, bitch. <laughs> Fucking stab this in the back. Stop. I don't give a fuck you're coughing. Fuck you. <laughs> This piece is just gonna get away, though. You know he's gonna get away. Oh, he, both can be true. <laughs> both can be true. What a Giga Chad, man. Melt might be the best character from this uh, human faction. This part. Huh? He has no guilt at all. He can just always just bring these guys back up. They're like zombie tools. It's so fucking annoying. Just kill them, Meld. Meld, just straight up kill them. Even if they're dead, they can be used as zombies. But what if you kill Daisuke right now, huh? What if we kill Daisuke? Then would, he, would these other guys be under control? Shizuku. Shizuku's gonna show up soon, right? Koki or Shizuku, come on, please. Giga Chad. Oh? <laughs> Peace! Damn, dude! He just jumped out the fucking window! What? Huh? What? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What? Is it too quiet outside? What's going on? Where is his voice coming from? Ah, shit. A demon's coming in, right? What the fuck is... No, it's not a demon, though. Oh, it's the girl from the beginning episode, remember? The first episode, there was an intro scene when Hatsume was fighting this girl. A worshipper of Lord of Heat. Who is this person? Is it straight from the church? Mel, please survive. Mel, please survive. I think it might be fine. We didn't really get to see him die like straight up. So maybe he'll survive later somehow. Oh, who is Daisuke working with? I know there's a demon girl that approached him. But who was it? The, the winged girl. The angel girl. So they're not really working with them. They're different factions. So. It just happens that the church and the demons are just kind of gangbanging us at the same time. Shizuku needs to fuck this kid up. But who's talking right now? Who is this? We're kind of seeing their face, but I don't recognize this hairstyle. Who is this? I mean, if we help them, I'm sure we're going to get some kind of reward. Let's go. Let's go flex on him. Huh? Oh, who is this girl? New girl? New barrier girl? Wait, who is this? Hajime, get in there. Come on. Imagine he shoots a bunch of missiles there. They all just die. <laughs> 
Yeah, we know, we know. Let's just run them over. No, straight up, just run them over. Don't even fight. No. County doesn't realize. Hatsume has other intentions. Run them over. Or just shoot them down like that. Sure, that works too. <laughs> Imagine you're people from this world. And you don't even know what a fucking car is, right? This is crazy to them. Just run them over. Come on, it'd be so much funnier. Man, you should just run these people over, man. Hmm. Classmate? Who? Princess! So she escaped! Oh! I thought that the princess was trying to, like, um, group up with Shizuku. Interesting. But now that Lily will tell Hajime about what's going on in the kingdom, we have a reason to go back. That makes a lot more sense. Lily's gonna join our harem, right? Probably. Does she even know? Because in season one, she was not even there. Do they even know each other? Okay, so they do know each other. But you know, in season one, she did not exist. So it's just funny to me. Oh, there's a romantic pledge like last episode too. That's what I'm saying, bro. Who the fuck are you? Like, does Hajime actually know or not know? Like, Princess knows. But I'm just saying from me, like season one. She didn't fucking exist, so I'm Hajime right now. I hope this is the anime. Straight up like, um... Breaking the fourth wall, right? Straight up saying, yeah, we know we retconned her in, but, you know, it's funny like that. <laughs> yeah, a normal person who saw season one would definitely not remember her, bro. Okay, she knows, she knows. What was that move then? What the fuck was that for? Because I was thinking about of a reason why Hajime would need to go back to the kingdom to save everyone. But here we go. If Lily delivers a message, it makes sense. Hajime, are you surprised at all? <laughs> but it's funny how the demons were trying to, or at least the people with Daisuke, uh, was trying to get rid of the church too. I like the church is not an obstacle. The church is pretty much helping you out. Who is behind all of this? I know God of Heat, right, is part of this, but I'm talking about like a like someone that's working for God of Heat or someone from the demon side. Damn. No, he was controlled there though. He was controlled at that point, right? And then she got yeeted. That nun. Was he also being controlled? No, it's not, the nun's, nun's not the mastermind, right? Probably also being controlled? Yeah, fuck the god, man. Nah, the church, the god, they're all corrupt. The god they worship anyways, god of heat. Hatsumi's already decided. He's, I mean, we're already driving back to where uh, the kingdom is, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, let's go. I mean, we're already driving there, right? It's, it's like, where, where, where are we going right now? We've probably been driving there the entire time. Wow. Yeah, fuck the kingdom, but we're doing this for the teacher. Nice to see Hajime has, you know, the teacher's best interest. He cares about her. I'll kill them all. Yes, even the soldiers, everybody else. Your dad included, Lily. God's age magic. But we have to probably defeat, uh... <laughs> it's been so hard. But you know, that winged, uh, the winged angel girl. If we defeat her... We get a different power? You did not just fucking say that. At, at, at least Mew isn't here with us anymore, so Teal can say that shit. Hmm? Hmm? The fuck? Where did the magic circle come from? What? Who's doing this? I know that the wolf dog thing just covered it up, but who made it there? Okay. Maybe that's the magic that's causing the zombie? I, I don't know. Okay, Divine Mountain, Aiko Sensei. It's the same circle. As we saw in the field. The irregular. No, not the irregular magic high school. That's Mahoka. This is Arifurata. The irregular. Hajime probably? Why are you touching your lips? Did we kiss Hajime before? Did she kiss Hajime before? Why did she just... Why did she just fucking kiss Wait, Hajime's already here? Oh, wow. That was, that was fucking fast. Where? Outside the window? Yo. <laughs> oh, air, we can just use air dance to get up there. It's just like... See, air dance is one of the most useful skills, man. Holy shit. In season one of all the magic for the monsters that we're still using, air dance every fucking time. Transmute too. All right, let's get you out of here, teacher. Come on, let's go. Well, that was a little bit too easy. God damn. So, yeah, she was touching her lips thinking about you. What the fuck was it? Did they kiss? Am I... Did she ever do CPR? I'm forgetting something, am I? 
Yeah, she went like this. Hajime Nagumo? <laughs> like, what the fuck? <laughs> That's your fucking theater student! Not romantically. Aiko sensei, get your shit together! She is so down bad, man. Careful, careful, careful. When you No, she probably fantasizes about this. She definitely fantasizes about this shit, bro. We're just trying to get you free. What are you fucking thinking, huh? How you jump into conclusions like that? No, she thought that you were doing the wall bang technique to riz her up, but she's beyond rizzed. The fans stick in her head, bro. 100% she'd be fired if she was a teacher in the real world, dude. Okay, well, that conflict was kind of too easy. Now what? Maybe the, the angel girl will show up and we'll fight now. Because a moon was out when we were fighting that angel thing. Yeah, to say he sensei. She's not going to be like, oh my god, you did this just for me. No, she wants to see you so bad. You had no clue, bro. She is so damn bad for you. Oh, oh, oh. In this angle, when she went down there, I know it's the hand grab, but when she went down there, because she's short, that was, it was toss back. Look where the hand went, dude. Even right now, it's kind of sus. <laughs> Fuck Shimizu. Shimizu deserved that, Sensei. No, no, he deserved to get executed. No, 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 Sensei. You need to learn. No, next time it's going to be Daisuke. When we get to Daisuke, Sensei, you better not prevent us. I love you. What is it? Okay, okay, okay. She realizes. Because we did this to get the blood off of her hand. She realized the hidden intent, maybe? Yeah? I think that's what she's implying here. Hmm. But what I want happened to be in, you know, to like, save you, Sensei. Yeah, let's go, enough, come on. Our harm's waiting. We should burn down the church, yep. I just hope that she's a oh oh angel girl the wing girl what is it who is it huh? oh it's a CGA monster I don't care about that nah they're just fodder it's fine it's fine the demons are invading though right it'd be nice if we got some backup from the beast people Oh? Angel? Winged angel girl? Who is it? What the fuck? Wait, that tower just got in... Were we just there? Hajime just... What the fuck? It's the... It's the... We gotta heat. Yes, not... This isn't gotta heat, but you know, this is the girl that represents God. She's dual wielding. Now surely we can beat her and make her join our harem, right? Noint. Anoint, okay. God's Apostle. Ooh, here we go. And this one seems like an actually like difficult fight because you saw in episode one how much he was struggling. Let's go. Next episode's gonna be hype. Finally, we get to figure out what was going on in the intro of first episode of the season. Noint, the Apostle of God. There's probably multiple apostles, right? If we beat this girl, do we get some kind of godlike magic? I don't know. If we beat her, will we? Jo will she join our harm? I don't know. I just want to fucking clap that Daisuke kid because he is so fucking annoying. If only Mel would just kill them, but no. Mel doesn't get it yet. I'm sure he's going to be fine. Now, moving forward, what's going to happen? I'm sure the demons are attacking. The CGI monsters need to be held at bay by, like, everyone else. Like, Shea, Kaori, Tio, everyone else. They need to fight that. So they can't really help Hajime fight. Wonder how this fight's going to happen. Because when we saw Hajime fighting Noint in episode 1, he looks like he was losing. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. But hey, if you're still here, if you did enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.